What's going on YouTube? Joker back again once again and today people, today we are back with another episode of Pokemon Sun and Moon Nuzlocke. But before we get started, go ahead and show some love to that like button. You already know that your support is appreciated. So, last episode we had a huge steaming pile of plot dropped on us and uh, yeah, now we're here on Ula Ula Island. We just beat our rival and now we're looking for the professor but I think I'm going to explore a little bit. I think this is, yeah, this is just the marina again. There's generally nothing there. Uh, then we got our friendly neighborhood Pokemon Center right here. Let's run in there. There's usually a couple people who want something there. Want us to do something for them. When your Pokemon evolves, do you think they feel like, yes, finally? I do. <laughs> Ula Ula Island is so big that writing a Pokemon doesn't always cut it for everyone. A lot of people take the bus, too. You know those times when you do nothing about it to just lay about? Seriously? I just got a Mewtwo through Wonder Trade? <laughs> Welcome to the Pokemon Center Cafe. The time is around 16. We have a special start today. Oh, nothing. I'm good. Let's see what these guys have. What can part by? What? You're not surprised that I have the Grand Champion Seal of Approval from the other place? No thanks. Welcome to the Techno Machine Shop. How may I help you? Bruce, Smackdown, Aerial Ace, Facade, Steel Wing, Payback, Rock Polish, Source Yes, Bulldoze, U Turn! Hold up, wait a minute. Let me come back for that. Because, you know, there might be some stuff that I want to buy, you know? You know, you know, they might have some, like, cool, I don't know, clothing or something. Da -da -da -da. Thank you for waiting, your Pokemon have been restored to full health. I guess I'm supposed to go in here, but I don't... Joker, it's been a while since I last saw you around, but were you supposed to be with the professor in the melee garden? Yeah, but the thing is right there. I really say you have to visit the garden. I don't want to visit the garden, I'm just going to get a tutorial. Yo, I heard that they serve tea somewhere in the middle garden. I'll start switching from the bridge where why don't you start around the edge of the garden? Haha! <laughs> what does this sign say? No riding upon Pokemon within the garden, except for Charizard. Okay then. Uh. All right, time for a commemorative photo. I just need to lose. Okay, for me, Kate, Kate, I just need you to lose. I just need you to take a dive. Right? Right, you can take a dive. Right, so I can get myself in. So I can get myself young. Right? Right, do bra. Uh, see, that Persian looks like a majestic beast. My Persian looks like a fucking mess. It's a hot mess. What is Persian? Normal height. Okay. We can switch to mom so I guess. That being said, none of its moves can hit me on the ghost, so... But I can, like, Oko it with Mega Punch or something. I don't know. Maybe. Is it Mega Punch a normal move? Mega Punch is a normal move. Well then. Well then! And here we go with Screech. Oh, thank you. 
Dude, I have my typings all mixed up lately. Perfect, use face attack. That sounds wore off Momzilla. Momzilla's just gonna be my punch again. You just wait till I get my Mega Evolution, though. You just wait until I get my Mega Bracelet. You're gonna suck for you. Lady Grey level 20s. I really need to turn that off, but I just don't care. Marowak. Switch Pokemon? Yeah, let's switch Pokemon. I highly doubt it's going to be the Fire variety. And if it is, well then, fuck me, right? Nope, the normal variety. Because he's a tourist. Marowak, I'm sorry. You're gonna get bloom doomed. you did! Fuck, man! It's like, I got your bag, bro. Don't, don't even worry. It ain't nothing. It ain't a thing. Tom grew to level 32. Tom wants to learn Power Gem. Forget old news. What? Power Gem. Uh, okay. Let's forget Faint Attack. Beyonce grew to level... Oh, I probably should turn that off. What did I say? What what did I say? Yeah, well, if I take a fall, if I take a dive, if I lose to you, good sir, I lose the game. And nobody wants to lose the game. Damn it! This is my encounter, isn't it? Please be something already up. Please be something already up. Please be something already up. Oh, dupes claws. They usually have better Pokemon, like, in the back of areas. <laughs> I'm hearing a side up. Something already have, be something already have, be something already have. Aww. Another bug flying. Come on, game. Just when I thought I'd caught all the crappy Pokemon in the game, the game one-ups me. That is not cool, game. That is not cool at all. While it is believed that... Starlight provides it with energy. This Pokemon also loves to eat berries in the daytime. It curls up in the grass to sleep. Would you like to give Lady Anna a nickname? Yeah. Yeah. I'm just so done. I'm just so fucking done with all these shitty Pokemon. And then I'm gonna run into something really cool. Really freaking cool here in a minute. Like, watch, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. I don't even know what I want to nickname this. Let's just go look up fucking nicknames. Lydian. Nicknames. Just see what they have on the interwebs. Hmm. Red Ranger, I actually like that. <laughs> Damn. Uh, we're gonna name it Red Ranger. I like- I like Red Ranger. Red 
Red Ranger. Go, go, Power Rangers. Send to the fucking box. Send to the fucking box. I should have named him Common Rider Red. But whatever. But, fuck it up. Runs a Psyduck. Right here. Hi, small child. Please, my Pokemon Day. Or something like that. School at Alley. I'm gonna beat this small child in a Pokemon battle. And then. I'm going to take their money. Mm. Because that is the circle of life. That moves us all. got destroyed and had to hand over your money, your milk money. But fine, oh, be fine. I'm fine, I'm fine. <gasps> I'm so mad. I'm so mad. If there's another room, be like, and it comes up with a new new name, I'm gonna be like, yeah, go. The water's so clear, huh? I wonder if Pokemon are all hiding in the shadows, the shadow of the rocks somewhere. I don't know. I don't fucking know. You know what I do now? That's a Psyduck somewhere, and I can't get it. Rare candy bar? Hmm. Not worth more levels or something? A big mushroom. Dynac. Of all the Pokemon, in all the places, it had to be. It had to be you. It had to be you. Got away safely. Got away safely. Of course. They I like how the trees look like cabbage trees. They're like just big heads of cabbage on them. Like, okay, okay. Give it. When I'm traveling, I just want to point out everything. Well, okay, you sound like a tourist. I mean, it's probably because you are. With your cell phone, and your Snapchat, and your Twitter net, your Radicate from Kanto, or anywhere else in the world other than. Aloha, hoi, aloha, hoi. Uh, white. Z power. And you're gone. A Raichu? Really? That's oh, a normal Raichu. It's so cute. I love Raichu. That move. Oof. That's the equivalency of a fire blast, by the way, ladies and gentlemen. Like, just so you're on the same page, that is a fire blast. Uh, I disclosed everything, everything about my Pokemon. Um, oh my. <laughs> I bet you disclosed everything. 
And then, you know, and then, and then, you know, you know, you know, you know what I mean. It was a child's game. Fuck my hair. Creature was sucked into the Zahyard Q. I mean, I might as well use repels at this point, right? I heard this garden was designed by people who came here from Aloha uh, to Alola from Johto. That would explain a couple things. Wait, is there anyone here? There's nobody at the ice cream stand. But I wanted ice cream. Damn it! Oh hi, Professor Kakawi, Kakai, Kakoi. I still can't say your name right. We're like 20 hours into the game, and I've been talking this whole time, and I still can't fucking say your name right. Hi there. Oh, what's going on with you two? Your eyes are shining extra bright, bright today. Did something big happen? Uh, only something amazing. Professor, Professor, you got to hear this. An ultra wormhole opened up, like, right in front of us, and there was this ultra beast in there, and you've got to tell Professor Barnett who. What? Did you get to see an ultra wormhole and an ultra beast? That is amazing! Oh yeah! <sighs> Sounds like an even better reason to train hard, yeah? Oh no, on your island challenge. Oh, maybe someday I'll go in. We'll be able to go through the ultra wormhole. All right, your next trial is up Mount Hokaula Unai. Haula Kanua Lulai. You catch the bus right here, just head out to the bus stop on Route 10, ya? Yeah? Oh, you guys can go ahead without me, Professor. I've got a hot date with the Madasada shop. Visiting every last one of them is my own personal island challenge, ya? Yeah? Roger that, oh, good buddy. We'll be waiting at the bus stop, Joker, whenever you're ready to go. Hey, Joker, did you know? Of course. I didn't even finish the question yet. There is an observatory on Mount Hoku La Kawanaya. And, and you, you do know what they do due to the observatory, right? I hope you do, because I sure as heck don't. Now, now, I'm gonna go stuff my face with something. I don't even know what it is. It looks like it's a, like a little plain burger. Probably like a wrap, some kind of wrap. And a four cheese burrito. I don't know. Probably has pasta in it. Sounds like something that would have pasta in it. I guess we never have to come back to the garden again. We probably do. God damn it, Lily. Joker, would you mind if I asked you something? Uh, you want to go to the ruins? Yes, I would like to take Nebby to visit the Ula Ula ruins, but they're located deep within the largest de large desert. I don't know what to ask. I don't want to ask that much of you. Right now, I'm planning on visiting uh, Malai Library. There's a book there that that I want to look for there. Maybe, maybe you'd even be willing to help me. I know that. Melee library is here within the city of Melee somewhere. Even even I should be able to find it. I can do this. That girl is a wonk. Strange creature was sucked into the Zahir cube. Bit of fancy, right? What? Hello there, Rotom. Are you feeling nice and comfy there in that Pokédex of yours? Never better. Wait. Wait. Wait! <laughs> ben Mullet! <gasps> Why, hello there! Good to meet you. I am Professor Oak. Samson Oak. I am the Professor Researcher looking into the regional variants found around here. 
And you, you must be Joker, huh? Young Kukawi has mentioned you to me. Rotom? You be sure to help this fine young girl on her trip around the island, all right? Who do you think you are talking to? Of course, I'm going to do that. And you, Joker. I'll be trusting you to keep Rotom safe as well. That young fellow from Kalos who helped invent the Pokédex put a lot of work into it. Ah, as much as I love to care for... As much love and care as any parent. I'll be in Mele Mele Library. Mele, Male, Male, Library. Mele, Mele. I'll be in Male Library if you ever need me. Feel free to stop by and chat anytime. If you're having trouble finding the library, just follow the Black Brick Road. Meaning the pattern of these paths, of course. Oh, black circles, black triangles, black squares, follow the pattern and you'll get there. Well... Aha! See, there's the, there's the patterns. There's the patterns. There's the, the patterns right there. This, this is a... Am I supposed to get behind this? Well... You, you'd figure it would center a little bit, you know? So I could, like, take a picture and get a selfie there. But apparently not. What is this? Oh, it's the little shop thing. Okay. It's a masa, ma, misa, misa shop. I didn't really care about all that. What's here? What's this? Is this like another battle cafe? Because I really. There's so many cafes in this game. I don't really particularly care for them. <sighs> Maybe we'll do that some other time. Maybe we'll do like a special cafe challenge. These people aren't gonna have any new haircuts. You have to get like, ooh, yeah, clothing shop. Nailed it. That's what I wanna see. Buy. As in, purchase. Halter top. Holla top! What? Well, that kind of makes the double layering irrelevant. Stripe halter top, stripe halter top, stripe halter top, stripe halter top. Flower print. Oh god, that's what I wear. That's the that's the starting shirt. Yeah, let's let's not do that. <laughs> Let's buy it. Flared denim. Flared denim. Flared denim. Sporty shorts. Sporty shorts. Nah, we'll, we'll actually go with the jeans, dude. Distress jeans one. Eh. Distress jeans two. Distress jeans three. Go with the first one. I don't have enough money for that. That's what I get for buying things. I'm not even paying attention to the back. I won't show the hats while I'm wearing the things. Mirrored glasses. Dude, the mirrored glasses? Yeah, son. That's what I need. Well, we'll worry about purchasing stuff later. Actually, hold on. Can I sell? Oh, no, you can't. Okay. That means I have to go find the track down the Pokemon Center. Okay. 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 Too bad they don't have jeans that come all the way down like jeans are supposed to. They're more like capri jeans. Okay. It's a shop all the way back here. It's nothing. Cool. Good to know. And this is something that hasn't been built yet. Let's talk to this guy. 
Uh, grimery garbage. But if they run out of garbage to eat, sometimes they start taking bites out of nearby buildings. We janitors have to use our formidable skills to keep them in check. Oh dear. Oh dear heavens. <gasps> Joker! Joker! I'm sorry I ended up getting lost yet again. I wandered around completely lost until I ducked into an apparel shop. And then I saw this outfit and they said it was at least what the last one they had in stock, so we bought it. Even though I don't think I've ever had the guts to wear an outfit like it. Uh, the woman working at the store did tell me where to find the library. So, I guess you could say that it was for the best. Though the library is actually right past the apparel store. But I just kept going. No. Yikes! Joke a bit a while, friend. Looks like your iron challenge is coming right along for me, everybody. That must be a pleasant thing in the two boot, the two part, two part, blah, 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 blah. So, Joker, who might this be? Uh, hello. My name is Lily. Oh, my apologize. Mudslide, mud, Mudsdale, 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 Mudslide, Mudsdale. I don't know what. Why didn't they just call it Muddale instead of Mudsdale? I, I don't. Mudsdale spooked you just now, didn't you? Well, now it doesn't seem like you're a traitor, traitor but uh, what are you up to? Uh, well, um, I'm actually, um, studying Tapu's ruins for various reasons of my own. Oh, shucks. Well, that's a fine initiative. But I'll be happy to show you the way whether you want to go. My mud's slide. Mud's Dale here is steady as a get all so she can easily carry you two. Thank you for the offer. Can you not? Shall we check out the Miley Library first though, since we're here? Sure, why not? I doubt there will be any Pokemon battles in this library. The book that I'm looking for is a very old one. It's a book that contains old myths and legends that Professor Burnett told me about. Those tales seem to suggest that the lowest legendary Pokemon came from another world. Well, okay then. Maybe I'll just use local knowledge? For free, you can read all the books for free, I swear, he'd live here if I could, but I don't want to die until I've read every last book in every last page in every last book in the world. Okay, dude. That's, I guess, uh... I came all the way from Johto to visit Olova. It is truly... You can't fly to fly around here. You can't use fly to... Is it true you can't use fly to fly around here? Ah, uh, I don't know, is it? Seems like it. I got told off for trying it. They said it was some kind of law or something. But that's how folks in Alola fly around? Uh, on a Charizard? Wow, so everybody just rides on a special Charizard? That's got to be a raise for the job? <laughs> it's been raised for the job? Sounds weird, if you ask me, but I've got to admit, riding on a Charizard would be a blast. Thanks for teaching me about how things are here in Alola. Here, yeah, you might as well have this. TM65. It's a TM? Oh! <laughs> what? 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 My brain just can't comprehend. My brain can't even right now. My brain is having a fucking meltdown. My worldview has changed. Everything is wrong. Black is white. Up is down. Left is right. Right is wrong. Sideways is... Well, still sideways, but the other sideways. You know how that goes. Fucking what, mate? Fucking what, mate? Yeah. Woo. Gee. Ugh. Just, just, I, oh, ugh, 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 taking a picture of that, sending it to everyone I know. Back where I come from in Johto, this kind of TM is a real big deal. 
It's called a hidden machine or HMs because they're so hard to get your hands on. Ah, oh, but here I guess it's just another TM. Maybe you can use it in battle or something. Uh, not really. Fly is kind of useless unless they buff the fuck out of it. I've heard that in a library somewhere. In this library, there's a book about legendary Pokemon said to be Alola's very own son. So you're talking about... Can I just click on the shelves? No. Okay. Well, there's Professor Oak. Let's talk to this little small child here. This is book for Pokemon. Okay, that's great. Hey, Professor Oak. Aloha, young Joker! Since you're out and about exploring your island challenge, you must already know about the regional variants, don't you? Yeah, I got one. Just as I would have expected. Yes, regional variants. They arise when the influence of a particular region causes a Pokémon's physical aspects and even type to change. If you have caught one of the local Persians, the regional variants, I'd quite like to see it. Oh! That's... That's a local uh, Persian, all right. I heard that having a round face can be considered quite cute here in Alola. Maybe that explains the Alola region variant. And since Persians are so smart, even before they evolve, it may be that they use extra energy born during evolution to instead help strengthen and bulk up their bodies. How very fascinating and alluring. And since this regional variant Persian evolves only with high friendship, I know that it's kind of wonderful trainer you must be, my young friend. Thank you, Joker. Let me give you this for a thanks. Oh, cool. I didn't know that. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, that cousin of mine in Kanto. He and I look remarkably alike. Or so everybody's always saying. He's Samuel Oak, though. He actually is the one who gave me this Kanto region uh, Pokédex that I carry with me now. For comparison, as I look at things in Alola here, Sam has a grandson, in fact, who is pretty astounding trainer himself. Boy's name's Blue. He actually sent him to some Z crystals as well, so who knows? Ah, maybe he'll come visit Alola, Alola too someday. Okay, I thought he might send me on quest to go get other variants of uh, Pokemon. So I guess we go upstairs. It must be a valuable book, so I'm not sure I'll be able to take it from the library. Is this what you're looking for, princess? Give it a read. Mm, is this what you're looking for, princess? Mm. Well, it's titled The Light of Alola. Aloha, Alola, Alola. I'll just, um, read it out loud, shall I? The empty sky broke asunder, a hole appearing where it had been none. A single beast appeared from it. It was called the beast that devours the sun. The king of Aloha bowed before it, and the beast that shone like the sun, the island's guardian, fought against it. But in the end, the beast had won. Then did the beast that devours the sun shine its light on the lion of kings. Lion, lion of kings. <laughs> then did the beast that had won bring nature's gift and bless all things. Beast of the sun and beast of the moon, through their union they brought new life, a fragile heir in a Lola born. The island guardian who keeps from strife, an ancient king sang their thanks for Sorgallo with the song of a flute. Two tones rang out across the altar, a perfect pair ever after mute. So we just learned about Soul Gallo. Mmm, is that great? My dad's books are all great. Wait, 
Wait. I mean, yes, it is, but did you say your father? Isn't this book very, very old? Ah, uh, yeah. It belonged to my dad. I know, I don't look much, but my family used to be pretty much royalty. I had to have all my dad's books moved here so they didn't get ruined by the Pokemon. I can tell you lots of other old stories about Aloha, too, if you're interested. Well, that would be quite wonderful. I would be delighted if you did. I think I'll stay here, but... I know why you've come to Ula Ula. You'll be undergoing another trial, won't you, Joker? Good luck with it. I read that Alua Alua's island's electric-type trial can only be reached by a bus on Route 10. If she's royalty, I like the, the motif because she looks like she's wearing rags. She's a, she's a queen, a princess of rags, king of rags. Uh, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for this episode of Pokemon Sun and Moon. Another plot-filled episode. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments below, and like always, stay frosty.